Hello everybody and welcome back to another Westworld episode. This is season 2, episode 4, The Riddle of the Sphinx. What is this? Oh my god. Was he really doing that? Isn't he too old? This is not Abernathy, is it? Because I truly do not recognize him. We have a visitor, Mr. Bellows. Shall I send him in? About time. Mr. Dallas. This is William's father-in-law. I'm sorry, guys. I'm telling you. I'm telling you, guys. I cannot remember pretty much anything. Names, faces, I'm bad at it. I'm gonna try to remember to tell you guys a story at the end of this episode. To me. No whiskey, no tobacco. Holy shit. Are you fucking kidding me? Stay the hell away from me. This is... We thought... We thought she died though. Well, I thought she died. What the hell happened here? Holy crap. This is a control unit printer. Kill them all. What the fuck is that? Don't threaten it and it won't hurt you. Oh no, she's gonna die. What the hell were they doing here? I think they were watching the guests. It's a protocol to evacuation and get you out of here. Thanks, but uh, I'm not looking to get out of here. Home sweet home, boys. What do you mean you're not looking to get out of there? You've been kidnapped, chased by a tiger. This happened before. You harbor even the faintest ambition in using that thing, and I'll turn that pretty face of yours inside out. And you know this time is for fucking real. <clears throat> so disrespectful. We need food. Making fucking deals. Not like a plan. This happened before, though, right? Yeah. I have this deja vu feeling. What the fuck are you doing? You. Let's make a deal. He just he shot someone. An unmarked grave. He said he didn't want to make a deal. A man who wants to deal. It's the new way. He sure knows how to have fun by himself. Do the you made it. You have a visitor, sir. About time. They turn him into a host? I'm no in California anymore, am I? 
If you can't tell, does it matter? Did you like him? So? William? Let's get him. Would you like to go ahead and terminate, sir? Go ahead. <gasps> what an asshole! Well, yes, that's... Jim is not real and shit. But it's... Done, my friend. I knew that was gonna happen. I knew it. You live only as long as the last person who remembers you. Anybody, Mamacita, ever. Ugh. There's an old. That's the wife, isn't it? So William kind of likes Lawrence, right? didn't die. It was a host. Or made a host that looked like him. He's hidden somewhere. glad that season two is so good. I didn't want it to react to it because I got a lot of hate comments in my season one. So I was like, oh, yeah, I don't want to go through that again. I really don't. And if I didn't react to it, I wasn't going to watch it. Let's just be real. But I'm so glad I decided to react to this season. Anyways, thank you so much for watching this episode with me and remember that if you want to watch the extended reaction, it's going to be up in my Patreon page. The link's going to be in the description box. And as always, I'm Sara Miana, and I'll see you in my next video. Alright, um, the story I wanted to tell you guys was that I was at a 
an outlet or something like that that it's near my house I was looking for a memory card for my camera and so I went to a store I went to like a million stores but the last store I went to uh, I asked for the memory card and then uh, t to one of the employees and and the other employee after a while uh, that I was talking to this other employee I'm saying the word employee too much but whatever uh, he was like ask my dad and I was like yeah I don't know who your dad is but he insisted right like he he jumped into the conversation and he insisted that I asked his dad and I was like who the fuck are you and in the end, I realized that he was my neighbor's son. So, yeah, I don't remember faces. Like, I haven't seen him much. The last time I saw him was, like, Christmas? No, Christmas. Uh, New Year's Eve. But, yeah, like, I, I never remember faces. I don't know his name, although I should know his name. His dad basically lives here like he comes every day every day several times a, a day and i <laughs> i didn't know who he was and it was so embarrassing and that was the story i wanted to tell you i am peter pan i'll never be a man if you never want to grow take my hand i'll take you to neverland i am peter pan i'll never be a man if you never want to grow take my hand i'll take you to neverland